What makes you think you're a high value man? The car you drive? No, the value I put out into the world. What about your character? I have great character. I built myself to basically have better choices. You want to know why? Because women can choose and make a choice. They can. They can say, I don't want to date a man that makes like six figures. They can. And then what are you doing? You're but demeaning a man. But we're not talking about that. Women That's not the about situation that happens. What I Listen, want to hold on. Peace and blessings, you ugly mofos, and welcome to another episode of He Rants. I am your host, Felix Long Trousers. Ah! That's it, that's it. Alright, let's not waste no more time. Let's get right into this reaction. With him, what was the turnoff? Specifically, the turnoff was when I asked that question right about now. would you date a single mother and Jacoby you proceeded to tell me that basically you're a high value man and you are too good for a single mother however you did also tell me that you were raised by a single mother which is profound for me to think that a single mother is not good enough for you but it's good enough for a woman to raise you that let's calm down <laughs> let's Let's calm down. So. Let's calm down. So let me ask you this. I would ask you this. Let me ask you, man. Let's say, God forbid, right? God forbid. Thank you. Let's say your father, uh, your father was a rapist, right? Let's say that he was a serial rapist, but he raised you well. Does that mean you should start dating rapists? Oh, you're, you were, you were good enough to be raised by a rapist. Or a pedophile or something like that. But you weren't. You're not. Good enough to date a, a, a rapist. Eh? It's the same logic. I don't care what anybody says. It's the, same, it's the exact same logic. It's the exact same logic. Oh you were raised by a single mother. So is that okay? You okay? Just because I was raised by it. Doesn't mean I have to. I, I have to date a single mother. That doesn't even make sense. Why? Why? That doesn't make sense. Maybe I seen what happened when I was raised by a single mother and that's not the life that I Well, then again, I guess that would solidify her point and be like, yeah, maybe you should date a single mother so they won't live the life. How about the single mother just don't become a single mother? Right? Having babies with the right guys. Or well, something like that. But this is this is crazy. This is nuts. Let's keep going. To raise you. That's unfair. And it's very insensitive to women out there who have children. Alright, so just because it's a cycle, I wanted to wanted to continue. I'm it doesn't just, have so, to continue. So what I'm saying is, it's, is that it's more about why would you cut off and say that single women are not on the same level? What you're supposed to learn from is history. So you're really? a very What's intelligent, no, 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 you're right. very no, intelligent no, no, no. woman. You're a very intelligent woman, right? Yes. So if you know, if, as a as a woman growing up, you know it's the less likelihood for you to be successful by having a child. So what you do, you be more proactive. Using condoms. What's that got to do you with your sure choice? Okay, if you're getting Can pregnant, then all right, cool. Maybe I shouldn't continue with having this child because I'm not. I, I'm not getting married. I should. I a better chance of me having a successful life. You're just talking about finding a man. That's Excuse what I'm thinking. Me. So you're you were raised by a single mother. Yes. And Is I, your mother? I, Okay, here we go. I feel an attack coming. <laughs> I feel an attack coming, right? At the end of the day, because it's spitting too much facts at one time, uh, it, it, it's, it's, it's overwhelming. It's overwhelming. <laughs> it's, it's, like, why are you speaking so much facts? No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Why are you? Why are you? He's throwing accountability around, guys. Stop him. Stop him. Stop. stop. Put, put the applause light on or something like that or, or the boo light on or something like that. <laughs> he's talking too much facts. He's speaking too much logic. Like, come on now. Yeah, why should I continue to trend? That doesn't make sense. You want me to continue to trend? Look at the black community right now. Ran by single mothers. Why would I? <laughs> hey, you see how the kids is turning out? I'm gonna. Nah, bro. Like, come on, son. Cuz is cuz is just telling. I'm making good money, right? Because he's saying it's high value. I'm hoping he's making good money. He's making good money. Why would I decide to raise another man's child? Because you made a bad decision in your life. A woman needs to break that down to me and make it make sense. You can't. You cannot make it make sense. You can't. You know you can't. No one can make that make sense. If I'm making a lot of money, why would I take care of another woman with their child? Who needs a financial assistance? Why would I do that? Let's keep going. 
single mother. Yes. And Is I, your mother still alive? I struggle. My mom's still did alive. Did she struggle or did you struggle? Both of us struggle. Okay. So your words mm -hmm. that echoed all around mm -hmm. social media, and I want to make sure that we have this clearly, were. I'm a high value man. I've done things to step up my echelon and I'm not going to settle mm -hmm. for a single mother. Yeah, Did I have sure. that correctly? I want to be clear. Yeah, it would be selling. Right. So what makes you think you're a high value man? The car you drive? No, the value I put out into the world. What about your character? I have great character. I built myself to basically have better choices. You want to know why? Because women can choose and make a choice. They can. They can say, I don't want to date a man that makes like six figures. They can. And then what are you doing? You're but demeaning a man. But we're not talking about that. Women that's not the about situation that Listen, hold on. That's not the conversation. woman can say, I won't date a man less than five. What do you mean that's not the conversation? That is the conversation. This is just the conversation. I'm telling you my preference. I don't want single mothers. If I wake up one day, I'm like, I don't want Samoan, Samoan women, which Samoan women are beautiful. <laughs> Polynesian Samoan women, they're beautiful. But what if I say, I don't want Samoan women? That's my preference. Just like his preference is saying, I don't want women with children. That's my preference. Just like he's saying like, yo, women can say whatever the hell they want. No one bats an eye. That's what he's, that's the point that he's trying to make. And she's talking about, no, that's not what we're talking about. We're talking about this. You want this specific thing, right? This specific thing. Because now we're bringing up, we're speaking too much logic. We're going back and showing you that you're not making any sense and showing you the hypocrisy in what you're saying, right? We're showing you the hypocrisy. You don't like that because it's going to hold you accountable. We got to retract this back. We got to talk about what we're talking about right now, which at the end of the day, you're still looking stupid. A cuz next to her, a cuz next to her must be her uh, her husband or boyfriend or something. He's stupid too. He's just that's the type of okay. Hopefully he's the father of the child. Hopefully he's the father of the child. My God, because if he's not, <laughs> oh my goodness, let's keep going. I can say I won't date a man less than five eight, and the man could be five four. Do they do they care about what does that have to do exercising all of those with men? anything? If a fat man is sitting here. He can be a fat man, right? Uh -huh. But if a fat woman is sitting here, you would say, oh no, we're body positive. Oh, no, we can't say that. We can't, it's all about picking her up. So every time you're saying something for a man, Bro, it's down. Bro, you got, you got a lot on your back, yeah, okay? Man. So what I'm I wanna mean, be I'm clear, just not just for you, but for everybody out there, is the car you drive, your resume, your bank account, uh -huh. your accolades is not what makes you a high value man. Not not. We are all not defined not. by the sum of our deeds and our character, and you, brother, are coming up to the sum of zero. Mm -hmm. A. Be man. Don't, there's more to the video. Don't shame. If I was him, I'd be acting just like him. Like, oh, okay, yeah, all right, whatever. Who says that? You? <laughs> like, y'all the ones who, you guys are the arbiter of truth? <laughs> like, you guys are the ones that are telling me, like, what, what, because, because you guys decide who the high value men are, right? You guys do, right? Talking about character and all that stuff. Y'all trying to shame me into dating a single mother. I don't understand this. You're trying to shame me into doing this. That's like, can, can somebody shame you? If something is of great value, right? Can somebody... Uh, is that the end of the video? Oh, that was the end of the, uh, that was basically the end of the video, anyways. Uh, but can somebody shame you into like, let's say if you're multi-millionaire, right, and you just want to buy a car, can somebody shame you into buying a Lambo? Oh, you don't want to buy a Lamborghini? Oh, you don't want to buy a, a wealthy, nice car? Or you don't want to buy this nice thingy? Does somebody have to shame you into something, getting something nice, especially when you're in the market for looking for something nice? Like you're in a market looking for women. Did I have to shame you into dating a single mother? I'm not sure if I'm making sense. If I'm losing people right now, man. But yeah, man, this is this is crazy. Uh, the host should be ashamed of herself, right? Because she's jumping in and just shaming. She must be a single mother her damn self. Um, that's the only thing I can think of. Um, but the, the thing is, Cuz was out spitting out a whole lot of red pill stuff at the end there. She's talking about, oh, you got a lot on your back. Like Slam, you understood every single thing that he just said. He might not articulated it beautifully right but it was it, it was enough you could comprehend exactly what he said and what he means and you understand that he's speaking on the double standards right as simple as that this is why a lot of dudes is going more conservative right because when they see this type of stuff this kind of lunacy the stuff that doesn't even make any sense whatsoever and it's like yo how am i surrounded with a lack of logic from everybody it's like i can't i can't live like this right and he dodged the bullet why would i want it she's just mad because he didn't want to be with her 
He didn't want to be with her because she's a single mother. I've worked, just like you said, I worked hard. Worked my way up, you know, to get where I'm at. And I will be damned if I'm going to use the resource and everything I've made to take care of another woman with her child. That's not mine. Now, the child is mine. Oh, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. It's my wife, everything. Let's do it. Yeah, of course. I'll take it. Use all my resources on her. But we're talking about somebody else's child, son child is never going to be mine no matter how much she calls me daddy or he calls me daddy the child is never going to be mine right people who, oh it doesn't matter we don't need blood to make shut the hell up this child is not mine bro like we're, we're playing make-believe we're playing make-believe all right i don't care if we adopt a child we're playing make-believe right oh we adopted this is my child yeah it's make-believe bro stop it all right so these type of situations, this is just don't don't let them shame you, bro. She she's wrong. She's wrong. Cause and this is how you know she's wrong. Cause if, if, let's say I don't know if she has a, a a son, but if she has a son and the son comes out and the son is making a lot of money, let's say he's a quote unquote high value man, or at least their standard of what a high value man is, and a and a uh, and she he comes home with a woman that had a baby, she'd be upset. Be like, yo, you couldn't find another woman. You you have so much money. You're a millionaire or whatever you are. Why don't you just be with another woman that doesn't have a kid? She would say that I've seen mothers do this with sons. I've seen a lot of mothers do this with sons. Even mothers who are single mothers doing this with sons. So that's why it's just like, you guys are full of shit. <laughs> like, y'all are full of shit. Like, stop it. Just be real, bro. Like, be real. Stop trying to shame these guys because you guys made bad decisions. You guys made bad decisions, bro. Be real, son. Golly. Hey, but what do I know? I'm just going to edit uh, If you stayed this long, I appreciate you. I love you. Make sure you hit the subscribe button as well as with the post notification. That way you'll always be one of the first to hear the voice. Same time, leave a like because I'm so damn insecure. Those likes definitely let me know I'm doing a stand-up job. Buy the merch, comment, share with your friends, loved ones, all that fun stuff. And that's all I got to say. Peace and blessings. You ugly more foes. And I'm out. <laughs>